Due to lockdowns or referred here in Malaysia as MCO or the Movement Control Order, the parents together with the children are now working and studying from home ever since the pandemic started more than a year ago. The children who used to engage themselves in outdoor activities are now forced to stay in indoor with limited movement speeds. In order to keep them occupied, parents started letting the children to spend more time on the gadgets. And these children, when they start looking at the screens, they never stop. They get addicted to their only source of entertainment. Sitting or lying down on the couch for hours. And then at one point of time, they start becoming restless. Trying to die with themselves or to just seek attention, they pick up fights with their other siblings or behave rudely to their parents or having total meltdowns. Where they end up getting scolded or punished by the parents or the guardians. In the end, we have stressed out kids and stressed out parents or guardians, which results to a distressed family. Some of the brilliant ways to handle the situation are by getting the kids to practice yoga, breathing exercises and doing some mindful activities by not only occupying their time these kids can utilize their energy into yoga postures which makes them move their body and start gaining flexibility these practices helps the kids to remain calm and to enjoy the present moment Practices are also proven to decrease stress. Breathing techniques, which will be discussed in the next slides, helps to increase the lungs capacity and develops healthy lungs. Other than strengthening the children's attention span, these practices also sharpens the children's ability to focus and learn. Here I'm sharing two fun field breathing techniques which can be taught to the children. The first one is balloon blowing. Blowing a balloon involves deep inhalation and exhalation. The force and strength of the lungs is tested in this activity, whereby it is not only a fun activity, but also strengthens the lungs. Next, is the feather blowing game where the task is to keep the feather in the air. It is indeed a fun game to be played in a group. And at the same time, this game develops a pair of strong lungs too. Now, this is called the breath pod. There are four breathing exercises shown here. Namely, the eight breathing, triangle breathing, square breathing, and star breathing. Parents can print out this page and let the children try out the breathing exercise. Next, let's look at the demonstration to use the breathe pod. We will start off with the eight breathing. So place the finger at the start point. From there, as you breathe in and you trace the circle, breathing in and as you breathe out, continue tracing the other side of the eight. Inhale, breathing in and breathing out. 
One more round, breathing in and breathing out. Right, and you stop at the start point again. Next, let's look at the triangle breathing. So from the start point, we are going to breathe at each side for a count of three breath. So from the start point, breathing in for three, one, two, three, hold on for three, one, two, three, and breathe out for three, one, two, three. Continue breathing. Hold and breathe out. One more round. Breathe in. Hold. Breathe out. Right. Now legs. Let's move on to the square breathing. From the start button, we will be breathing in for four, holding for four, breathing out for four and hold again for four in a circular motion. So the finger on the start but start point and from here breathing in one two three four hold one two three four breathe out one two three four hold one two three four continue tracing breathe in last one is the interesting one called the star breathing where from the start button at the side of the star okay, each side has it breathing in holding at the point and down breathing out as it escalates down the line so start button and from the start point breathing in start and hold and from there breathe out and again breathe in well. hold breathe out so continue right. breathing as you so breathe in with me Once done, you can conclude the session. Now, this breathe board is a very exciting tool that you can use give for the children. So you can also laminate this piece of paper once printed out for it to be used for a longer time. Thank you.
that is my presentation for today thank you for listening have a great day namaskar thank you thank you everyone for watching yeah we are back <laughs>